What's up guys, it's Husky here and today we've got a different type of video. I'm actually in Minecraft as you can see right now and we are going to check out the release of the Minecraft experience from Disclosure. That's right, they've released their own energy Minecraft experience which is related directly to their new album release which just came out this weekend. Uh, it's their third LP, it's banging, it's got some hot house tracks and uh, what better way to celebrate an album than with a Minecraft server? Now the server is only going to be up for one week from the release today so if you want to check it out with other people be sure to hop on the server address I'll leave that right below and yeah we're going to go check it out and see what this is all about. Alright so there's the server just right there play.disclosureofficial.com the server will be up until September 4th of this year and if you don't make it through that date I think they're going to make a way available for you to uh, play it offline as a single player option, so you still have that available uh, But okay, so here we are uh, At the spawn. It's gonna recommend a serve uh, custom resource Yeah, let's do that custom resource pack And uh, so the goal of this is to find hidden crates uh, We're essentially crate digging as it as it is with vinyl So we're gonna go find some some nice vinyl tracks out on the island here Um if you come in for the first time, it's probably going to be playing music from the album. I went ahead and turned my music slider off for that just because this is YouTube and uh, you don't want to get copyright strike. But if you want to enjoy the music, then uh, you you just need to turn your music fader on or off. I still have jukebox uh, notes though because this, this, uh, this server does contain, once you find the vinyl, uh, you can also find, I think there's three distinct clubs you can find throughout the island uh, to to put the records into a jukebox. And so they have like 8-bit versions of their tracks, so we're going to go look for them. Alright, I, I don't play a lot of Minecraft, I'm going to be honest. Uh, I've had this skin for ages, we got Thomas from Daft Punk here. Uh, look and fly, they got the cape, so we can fly off the spawn area. There's different signs here with directions. Uh, but yeah, basically we're just gonna go crate digging, explore the islands, wow! And there it reveals itself. Look at us, we're flying! Where are we gonna land? There's so much to explore here, dude. Oh my goodness. Look at all the trees. I mean, it is Minecraft after all. All right, sick. Uh, all right, well, we just landed somewhere. We have a compass with us, which points to the nearest crate. I don't actually, okay, so there's a menu that says open crate zero. I don't know how many in total there are. It looks like there are nine discs to collect. So yeah, there are just supposed to be chests scattered around. And I don't know if every chest contains a disc necessarily now if somebody else in the server finds a disc and plays it we might be able to hear it since we are on the server and there's people in the chat who are also searching around I'm just kind of doing my own thing though until we find the cool stuff Yo, okay, we found a, we found a, found a crate. Gotta open it. Whoa, okay, we got some stuff. Diamond sword. What do we need with all this? A disc crate key? Left click a disc crate with this key to receive its goodies. And a totem of undying. All right. Nice. Well, we found a crate. Hey, look, here's another one. This one is actually empty. But it's a disc key, so we need to... Oh, did I just loot it? I didn't get anything from that one. I don't know if I did that right. Okay, so when you loot the chest, they just... They just despawn, I guess? Oh yeah, I see one in the distance. Okay... Nothing.
I looted a key chest, but I didn't get anything. Huh, okay. So next time I run into one of those, I'm going to try to use the disc crate key on it, maybe. I'm not sure. Some of these just may, just may not have anything in them, which is fine. And we can also, like, if we're getting stumped, we can go back to spawn. And just pick another vantage point. Oh, somebody opened the disc crate. All right, because I know there's like an Arctic area somewhere. And there's these signs here that point. Guy's kitchen, 337 blocks this way. All right, let's just try for it. Woohoo! We're flying. All right, nice. So we're in the Arctic area. This whole island represents the album cover, by the way. I'll show that in the thumbnail. But uh, it is super cool. All right, we need to use our compass, don't we? So let's go in the direction of the compass. As we are trying to climb this terrain. All right, we're scaling this mountain. There's got to be something up here. Is it in the edge of the mountain? I'm on the other side now. Hey, there's a guy. All right. Oh, found it. Okay, I gained some experience from that, I guess. Oh, it's a disc crate. So with our key, we can open up the disc crate. Yo, we found our first disc. Okay, sick. Put that there. Eight bits. W-Y-S. And a splash potion of leaping for an eight minute jump boost. Sick. So now we need to find a jukebox to play the record. And then uh, we can vibe out uh, for a bit, you know? Here in this Minecraft energy experience. Might as well open some crates on the way. Yo, we got a key. Dude, let's go. All right, so we have another key. So if we end up finding another disc crate, we have a key for it, which is dope. So it seems like these crates that we're finding are a one-time use across the server. So whoever's the first one to open it, and then new crates will spawn periodically. That seems to be the way this works. There's also a random beacon up here. Now, does that pointing to the new disc crate? Dude, we gotta fly. We gotta fly there. Let's go check it out. Yeah. What is this? Ah! What is this? Beacon of mysteriousness. There's got to be something underneath. If nothing's on top of it. Yo! Wait. How did we get here? It's just... It's just hiding there, man. Wow. Okay, let's get back up. <laughs> I got to see it from a distance real quick. But yeah, dude, there it is. Wow. <laughs> the beacon kind of shows you for, for it. But this must be one of the underground clubs. Yo, it's Guy's Kitchen! Check it out, my dudes! I love it, man. Yo, check it out. Sick, it's even got like a cave underneath. Oh my goodness. We could go explore later, but first I need to find the jukebox. Where's the jukebox? Is this the jukebox? Jukebox, where are you? 
Yo. What's up, my dude? We got a guy here. Oh, this is the back entrance? No, this is where we came from. Um... Oh, here it is, right here. All right, let's play this. All right, this is WYS. Let's pop it in. Dude, I love it. <laughs> this must be one of the new tracks off the new album. Oh man, and we're just still vibing. What's under here? So Guy's Kitchen just descends into this mysterious basement of a cave. Got some lava action. <laughs> ah! No, I don't want to die. Need the water. All right, well, there's nothing much else here. All right, guys. Well, this was just a really quick, brief look at Disclosure's Energy Minecraft experience. Super dope server they have built here. This is obviously Guy's Kitchen as we explore today. But there are, I think, two more. Uh, underground clubs or areas where you can also pop your disc into the jukebox so there's a lot more to discover that I want you guys to find on your own and enjoy this experience while the server is still up I think this will be up until September 4th after then there will be a way to play single player I'm not sure the details on that you can find it on their website uh, but yeah this was a cool experience we've got more records still to find so we can enjoy this for the week ahead uh, but let me know what you found in the Energy Minecraft experience. What you think of the new Disclosure album. I think it's pretty sick. I love it. Uh, but yeah, let me know how you enjoy it. And thanks for watching. This is Husky signing off for now. See you later.